Okay, I'm leaving tomorrow, I'm heading to town to figure out stop and do some gold panning. Oh yeah, I'm gonna go right down there. Or maybe I'll go over there. Yeah, there's some real fine stuff over there. Right, right there, that's where I'm gonna go. Only issue is I forgot my tripod. So I have to find some way to hold the camera. You, I'll show you over the side. There you go. Okay, I made it. Bush back down through there. Uh, like I said, I don't have a tripod. I forgot it under my rush to get out here. I'll get the sandy stuff here first. I also have to hold oh, that cable. There's a cable there. Okay, let's see what we got. Oh, oh, oh. One sec. Okay, try it this way. Oh, what am I doing? I got my cork boots. Let me step right in the water. Oh, yeah. Water is freezing. Oh, there's some black sands. I think. We'll see here. Yeah, some black sands there. Come on. Come on. Get rid of some more. Oops, sorry. Wasn't looking at the camera. Okay, here we go. I'm way out in the middle of nowhere. Way out in the middle of nowhere. I love it out here. Okay. Well, oh, there's some black sands there. That was just a scoop right off the top too. Is it gold though? No. Let me try it again. Let me just go this again. That was pretty fast. Do this again. Get some of that lights off of there light stuff. Okay, let's try this again. Oh, need a little more water. Oh, now I got a stick in there. Come on now. Okay, here we go. Here we go. Uh, just one little speck. That's all I want. Just one little speck. Tiniest fly poop is all. Is all I need. Oh, bummer. What a bust. Okay, so I'm gonna do a couple more of my new gold pan invention, which I'm not gonna show you guys. Guys, it's a prototype. It's a cool prototype. I'm really excited about it. So I'm gonna get a couple 3D printed versions made up um, there's a few things I want to test I'm really excited about it it's it's different than anyone else's you operate it differently it's so cool yeah well make sure you guys can see it in the background there okay I'll have to blur it out if it's in the background um, probably oh a few months or maybe sooner yeah, so I get 3D printed, test it out, and then find out which one I like, and then try and get it a small sample batch made up of like a few hundred or something. I'm not really sure what the minimum requirement will be, but it'll be injection molded, just like my power wedges. So maybe I'll go to the same manufacturer. We'll see. I'm really excited about it though, because my hobby is gold panning. I love, well, 
prospecting, gold prospecting. So I've got some hard rock claims. Uh, I don't have any place for claims. I did, but I let it lapse. It wasn't very good. I got a couple hard rock claims too. I got, I got one that's like, well, two, two claims side by side. Got a really good hard rock, really good. But it's really remote. I'll be going there this uh, summer with my cousin. That's gonna be so much fun. I'm gonna film it. I have like a drone, I have a couple of cameras. Really, it's gonna be really exciting. If I find a piece of gold, I'll show you. Okay, see you guys in a bit. Okay, so here's my invention. I'm gonna fill it right. Oh, Holy, it's heavy with all this dirt. Holy smokes. I got a big metal pan. Oh, that's heavy. I don't think that's even gonna float. That may not float. <laughs> that's not gonna float, there's no way. There's no way. Let's see here. Nope, it just sank immediately. Let's get rid of the, half of this stuff. Let's see what that does. Come on now. One handed, because I forgot my tripod. Oh, it bugs me so much. Forgot my tripod in a panic to get out here. Oh, it bugs me so much. Okay, float. Nope. Nope, 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 that didn't work. The bugger is supposed to float. Not supposed to be that heavy. Okay. Let me just get rid of this, some of this. Come on. It's not working as, because I'm holding it with one hand, it's driving me nuts. Ah. Okay, here we go, here we go, here we go. Yeehaw! Okay. You. The water's coming up through the middle, getting forced out to the edge and over at the top, and so is all the dirt, just like a centrifuge. Yeehaw! It works, my invention works. I just gotta, I gotta throw some gold in there, like purposely put some gold in there and see if it catches it. But look at all that. See, all caught in the riffles there. I mean, it's a crude invention, or a crude prototype. Look at that, caught in the riffles. Um, yeah, caught in the riffles there. More on that side. Oh, I'm so excited. Okay, what we're gonna do, oh, man, I just bugged me, I set the camera up somewhere. How am I gonna do this? I don't wanna drop it in the water. Oh, okay, well, I got like five minutes, so I gotta go pick up another followers there. Shoot. Oh, almost dropped the water. Oh, geez. Okay. Use this rock. So like this. And I'm taking a big chance here. Oh, it's slipping in the water. Okay. It's not going as planned. Put that there. Okay, put that there. Okay, that's sort of sort of set up. Get that little rock. Jam that in there. Okay. Well, that's the best I can do. I hope it doesn't fall in the water. Just do not fall in the water. Okay. And it's raining. Okay. Let me just see whereabouts. It is in the camera. So right, is that in the middle of the camera? Yeah, right about there, okay. So here's my invention. Okay. I was gonna hit and hit some rocks down here. There we go. Here we go. A little crude with the, yeah, it's not gonna work. Ideally, you want to scoop, but I'll just use my hands. So they go fast, I can go through this material. I think I might need to make that hole in the middle a little bigger. Oh, I dropped my hand. Hold the dirt, tipped over. Yeah, is this, are you getting this on camera? See? Woohoo, look how fast I'm going through this material. Yes. Oh, gotta get a, a better handle. I just, I wasn't sure how I was gonna make the handle. Right now, I've just got a rope tied through it. I'm not really sure how I'm gonna make a better handle. I think I have some ideas, but 
think I might need to make that hole a little bigger. Yeah. I need some more water coming in through there. There. Bam, just like that. This is completely full. Within like what, 20, 30 seconds? It, she's uh, done, just like that. And then what you do, I'll just spin this, make sure I get it all washed through. <laughs> okay. Now there's tons of dirt in these riffles, tons of dirt. So then you just get your regular pan. Okay, regular pan's sitting out in the water. Stay. I don't want to get my fingers wet. The water's cold. Okay, stay. And then you scoop up and you just shake it into the bottom pan. Make sure the pan's staying still. But my, this is like I say, a prototype. So I'm using uh, a metal pan that I bought. So the the prototype that I get 3D printed, the bottom here is going to be sloped into the center. So it's going to be a lot easier to wash the uh, cons or what's left in the pan through the hole in the middle. It's going to be a lot easier. But this works. It's just slower that works but yeah if it was cold like yeah you know I explained it already if it's angled in sloped sloped to the hole in the middle yeah so right now I just got some round stock I'm not sure what size it is I think uh, thir 13 16 round stock and I, I bent it in a roller and then I welded it and then I siliconed it up with some silicone that's supposed to be for my uh, house siding the house is brown so i got that brown silicone well it comes a logging truck i'm gonna pan this out it comes that logging truck Awesome. That's an off-road truck. You can carry, I think, they can carry three highway trucks, I think, which is like 150 meters. And now, let's set the camera back up. Drop that now. Okay, where is that? Where's that rock there? Okay. Let's pan this out. Of course, I just grabbed the sand on the top of the top of the surface there right on the surface so I didn't dig down I don't have time I gotta go I gotta leave in like two minutes go pick up the other guys just didn't have enough time try this way Let's see what I'm doing yeah I'm pretty excited I wanted I was hoping to have like a weather day or have all day come down here and pan. Being that it's winter, I thought for sure I'd get weathered out. For sure, but I was doing conventional. So it's uh, a lot harder to have a weather day. <laughs> You're more likely to get all your days in when you do conventional. Got some big rocks in here. Oh yeah, there's some black sands in there. I don't think there's any gold. The first pan I did didn't have any gold, but there was some black sands. Actually, I'm gonna get, I'm gonna get rid of all the light lawn sand off of this. There we go. Got a few pebbles in there. Okay, I'll turn the camera out. Be careful, don't drop in the water. I got a lanyard here. A lanyard on my phone. I put my hand through this. Here we go. Oops, come on now. Hard to 
look through the phone and look through the pan. Lots of black sands. So I know it's catching the heavies, but there's no gold, which is no surprise. Let me just go this again in case I missed some little tiny piece. Yeah, I got it right there, right on the surface. Like I say, I only had like 10 minutes. See anything? See anything? Come on. No. But it is black sand, all right. Woohoo! Yeah, there's nothing. There's nothing. Anyways, I have to get out of here. That was fun. Oh, I wish I could just spend all day here. We're in the middle of nowhere. Miles and miles from camp. The camp is many, many miles from the nearest town, little town. Ah, yeah. But that's it, right there. See? The spirals, and there's the hole. I think there's a three quarter inch. Yeah, I gotta make it maybe a one inch and give it a try. And then I did, I did put the rope here, but I was testing out my wheelbarrow and I kept hitting the size of the wheelbarrow at home. So then I put a hole here and then I was trying it from here because before I was just using my finger. <laughs> and that worked really good. So I put a, the hole here and put the rope here and it works really good. So, I mean, I don't know if I can, I don't know if I can do it like that as a production, like final product. Maybe I could put a hole there and then put a plug and then they cut, whoever buys it, they can have the option of putting the rope there or there. So I was gonna have a rope and then have like a, a ball, right, that swivels. So you can, cause this rope kind of twists up, but if I have like a ball here with a swivel, and then I can spin it. That works great. But the uh, the 3D printed prototypes is gonna have way more riffles, more like a centrifuge uh, Nelson bowl, I think they're called. It's gonna be similar to that. There's gonna be way more and then with an overhang so it can really catch the heavies. It's gonna be way better. Like I say, this is gonna be tilted down from the edge to the center. It's gonna be tilted down. So it's gonna be really easy to clean up, um, to get all the heavies and clean it up and get it down to the center and then into this pan, into your next pan. Oh man, I just wanna go panning every day. Okay, I gotta get out of here. See you guys later.